Alright, what up everyone? I'm Fatboy Smurf and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. What we got going on here? Library Annex, is there anything else in here? No, I've done that right. Have I done that? Have I not? Wand handles, gold tracking. I mean, it was close to the... I think it was close, I don't know. I would assume if I've done it, it would just disappear, right? <coughs> mm, damn, she closed the doors to me, I'm sorry. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Oh no, is this a different side quest? Okay. Nice. Oh dear. I shall get in trouble for this. Is everything alright? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. <coughs> I'm Cressida, by the way. And I'm afraid everything's not alright. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. Uh -oh. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. <laughs> that sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I'm I collect sure the mind. books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Oh, Perhaps no. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why did our meat tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. Okay. I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. Go. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Alright. Let's-a go. Loading. Ah, okay, so that's what a symbol means. Gotcha. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. Hell yeah. Easy mode now. Press the chest. Okay. Play with the globe. That's what we like to do here. Play with that globe as well. There was one around here I saw it. Where are you? Oh, sorry, buddy. I was around here. I mean, it's not a big area for books to be flying in. Oh, there's one. Back here. Akio. That was a lag spike there. I didn't appreciate that. Locked. But I need that book. Where'd it go? Thank you. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were her. Yeah, we're not reading the diary. What the hell? Run, 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 run. Play with the globe. Akio! God damn it. Where is it? No! Yeah, that's what I thought. Get your ass back here. Oh, did you? Oh, my God! Ah! 
Right. Oh wait, that wasn't a bloody one of the books. God dang it. I saw the trails of a book. Get back here. Why was it trying to get me to read the diary? <laughs> of all these books I grabbed, I was like, yeah, you, we'll open the diary for you. Like, yeah, bro. Alright, I'm guessing the last one is in that restricted area. I'm so. Oh, I thought I knocked all those books down. So I'm sorry. There was a red dot right underneath it, and I don't know why. Are you still? Oh, you are over here. Get out of here. Thank That's you. the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Oh my god, my eye is so itchy and I don't know why. Come on, load up. Thank you. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. <laughs> nah. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Thank hey. goodness some people are trustworthy. Ooh, I got three of the side it's quests done. Oh, there's a interact button in front of me too. Nice, nice. Oh, challenges, thank you. No, it's not for that. It's not for that. It's for this. Right. Why that portrait was empty? Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. Yeah, I saw a flying book around here. Oh, there's something else to collect real quick. Challenges. Oh, I've not been collecting any of these. Oops. Oh, I have. I just got to do that one next. Gotcha. Can I? Oh, I can't just select it there. Nice. Alright, let's, let's, let's look at the gloves. Nah. These ones will do. Ah, uh, what spectacles. No magical properties. Well, okay. No magical properties. Offense, defense. Kind of upgrade. What? To it, you know how it ends. None of those are black, so I assume there's no other quests. Let's go. I see this. Oh, what the hell am I going to? 11. Wait, what's that? What as simple as that? Tell. That is that. I don't get it. What am I? Oh, well. Oh, well. See, I found out that symbol there. It's loading the next area. I saw PC and all that green. All donations will be going towards upgrading the PC. What up, pretty cat? Well, well, well. Nice. Oh, okay. That was an interesting sound. 
Like Handy resource that, indeed, right. your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Okay. Weasley after class. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah, there you are. Yep, here I am. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? Yep. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. What about Hogsmeade? Now, regarding the trip ah. to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? Jay Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. That's nice. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration oh, magic. Is that one we'll get my pet? There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. Nice. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Let's go. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time <coughs> with them. I'll go with Sebastian just because... I'd like to go with do, Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard. And he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavoury local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. <laughs> Oh, but that butter beer. All right, give this door. What's this? Oh yeah, your assignment. Sometimes I types a quest given to you by versus that when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be mending charm. Quite to complete other quests. Okay, that sounds important. Sure, let's do it. Oh, oh there you are. I have to do this first anyway. I see the main question. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that the mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. 
A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few <sighs> preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Um. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Oh, well, it just covered my entire screen. Ah! Got it. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Um, one minute. Brilliant. Uh, I don't see how many I was going to need to get, but sure, I'll talk to you. Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Oak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. I'm sorry the other students weren't more friendly. That's kind of you. I suppose there are a few decent souls here. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Interesting. Gobstones? Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. I mean, I can see why you're Imelda not like this. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. <sighs> Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. <sighs> okay. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high okay. got up there somehow. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Are all your gobstones here, though? That's the main question I have. Or are you going to want me to go around the entire school? I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. hate this. And I'm away. Oh, there's a red... Yeah. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. done quickly and then I can get to Hogsmeade and do all that stuff. Sprint, damn it, sprint. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. 
How is this? Revelio. Hmm. Okay. How nice to see you, my young friend. I see you too. Thank you. Oh, I bet. God, this is such a good game, though. Oh. I'm not playing a second file like off screen and stuff. This is my main file I'm playing through. You guys get to see it all. Those screens are killer though. Oh, I wish I had a top spec PC. Found it. I've been keeping an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah, found it though. Akio! Lumos! Levioso! <laughs> I'll get it in the end. Spam everyone until I do. Oh, that's cool. Oof. Gotta keep on going up. So I'll come back for that one, I guess. Grand staircase. Hell yeah. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Oh, I did. What are you up to now? Talk, who spoke to me? Rebellion. Oh, I see it. Trophy room. Akio. That's the last of Zenobia's gobstones. I should go and see her. Oh, that's upstairs. Okay. Yeah, let's do the run back. I mean, I can just... Where is it? I'm here. I need to get... Uh... Here, right? Yeah. So we'll fast travel there. No. Nope. Wrong buttons. Just pushing them all. The wrong ones. What up? Wait, where are you at? Oh, you're underneath me? Okay. Yeah, man. Oh, did I fast travel to the common room? Is it? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. Woo! What I hope you've had more that? luck than I did tracking down my... Hello, Zenobia. I, I found did. all your gobstones. Really? I didn't think it was possible. However, did you do it? Common sense and basic magic. Well, <clears throat> may I have my gobstones back? Of course. They are yours, after all. Oh, how wonderful. I shall dedicate all of my future victories to you. Speaking of which... 
Now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. <laughs> I'm sure they'd be willing to play after the trouble spent getting them back. It's a fine idea. Isn't it? Oh, we'll have so much fun together laughing as all the losers get sprayed, which won't include me. Very well, off I go. Wish me luck. Good luck. Thanks for the XP. Alright. Now then. Back to main mission. How do I track the main mission quests? That one, thank you. Oh, I got the one from here? Oh, okay. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh, we've got to put extra buttons in now. Hua! Yeah. A chow. Nice. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. Ouch. It Prepare. allegedly oh, symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a guilty lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Rebellion. Oh, I thought you might give me a bit of paper to say, hey. Ooh, leveled up! Oh, it's one there. Okay. Now I get to go here. Ancient magic, ancient magic throw. Ooh. I don't know what I'm doing with those doors. I'll figure out at some point. At some point, I'll, I'll probably do it off screen. She's a boy. Oh, okay. Probably do off screen while I just run around and try and collect everything. Maybe when I've ended the well, game. Fancy meeting you here. I know, right? Let's go. Hello, Sebastian. <coughs> ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Let's. You want to 1v1 me on the way, bro? You want to be slapped up and clapped up? People rendering in. There we go. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Forgot to read the chapter. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. Hell yeah. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. <coughs> Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. I spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Oh, you're welcome, then. Glad I could be of service. 
Madame Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor so Weasley good. came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. <laughs> she thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Okay. Collected. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look! What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already made. That's cool. I like that. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Oh, that's cool. God, this is a big world. Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? A little. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. You know, I battled some knight statues. Do all that cool stuff. I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. I bet it will be. Otherwise there won't be a game. Ooh, what's this beast map symbol over here? Hold up. I'm exploring. Don't hate me. Ah, oh, I said don't. Don't hate me. I. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. <laughs> what did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Okay. A Demi, guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon. <laughs> Mr. Moon is a character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Yeah. All right. Ooh. That load was very good. Honestly, How if one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Hell yeah. Case looks nice. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes. Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. 
and a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Then with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide map. Okay. Ooh, there was a fair bit here, isn't there? Show shops and points of interest. You can track. Okay. I mean, I should go and do all the points of interest, right? What's this? Sporting needs. Hog's head. Yeah, we can run around and grab everything, all the points of interest, real quick. <coughs> Shops can wait. Hmm. Meow. I'm zooming. Oh, there's a fast travel point there. Revelio. <laughs> Give me that. Don't mind me. I'm gonna just steal some of your money. I'm gone. Some of these nuts as well. Bye. Platoon. We'll go here because I should be able to get that fast travel point on the same way. Yeah, I can run right here and grab it. Meow. That a bank. I'm running past the door. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. No, oh, you're just the one I need to go to, right? I'll come back to you. Oh, I should do it while I'm here. Just do your chest. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though. I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Well, I obviously want the recipes. Ah, oh, you're giving them to me for free, ain't you just a Feel delight. free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. God damn. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Yeah, I'm in a rush today. I'm sorry, my guy.
Alright, let's go. I am not paying every single item I see. I'm sorry, but no. Ah, oh, it's this place. Akio. Revenue. Oh, there's the. been here. Let's continue. That's a cool place. Oh, they stay there. Oh, okay, I thought that was going to be a... Um, let's see what goes on this then. A beauty supply shop. A clothing shop. Let's go there. See if we can get some mad drip, bro. What can we get from working in the rest? <laughs> Just help myself to everything to worry about it. Oh, I'm not gonna have enough money for this stuff, am I? That's a fair point. I mean, unless you're gonna be like, hey, first time offer. Why can I not talk to you, Adele? Oh, okay then. Or do Ollivander's last? Um, I think this was what I need. Oh, that's Ollivander. I need to go here. And... I assume here then? No? Oh, here. We go here first. Sorry. My legs are just made out of steel, I guess. Meow. Akio. Yeah, I saw you. Well, hello there. What up? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess, you're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients damn, to pick your interest out with. So wager. much. Oh, damn, I've got stuff that's just better than what I've got on. Whoops. Hold on, what's it? Oh, wait, 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 let me grab that. Let me grab that. Let me grab that. Back, 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 back. Let me. Rebellion. Grab that. Now then. My gear. Where am I? Here I am. No tree applied over oh, because we better defense. I'll equip it. And then isn't there a thing where I can hide it? Change appearance. Oh damn. Yeah, hide them. Thank you. Nice. Do I have any neck work? Do you give me anything? No. You do. 
plus 7 defense, plus 4 defense. Thank you, plus 7. Thank you. And then, yeah, we'll just alter its appearance. Two look extremely fly. You know what I'm saying? Ah, got off me there. You don't do anything. Alright. Anything new in the challenges I've got to claim? Oh? Yes, there was. Ah! Oh. Alright, so this is the assignment stuff. Oh, the red scarf. Interesting. Alright. Now to the scrolls. Wherever that is. Right down here where we started. Where we came in from. Gotcha. I wish I'd paid more attention. Ah, the secret is through the hard work. Open this door. All right, finish loading. Thank you. An inquiring mind. So what do you think? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. Nice. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Yes, let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Give me that. And that. If you're interested, I can't get feel free else. to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Revelio. Where is it? We've got a scroll thing in here somewhere. Ooh. Now let me just steal some of your stuff. Ooh. Hello there. Hiding stuff, are we? Come on. Come on. There we go. Rebellion. What's this? Oh yeah, I, I can't do anything. I've got no money. I could sell, I guess, with the other random stuff I have, but uh, we'll wait first. Oh, another globe to spin. If I do anything, I have another robe. Plus ten, yes please. Looks eh, not terrible, but Oh, I can take the hood on and off. Can I down all of it? Oh yeah, look at that. Sure, we'll have the hood up for now. Keep it different a bit, you know. 
Don't worry, I'm not here to murder you. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, hmm. uh, mm, hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, I... Uh, about time? Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. Hell it's yeah. a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Oh, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. <laughs> well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. <laughs> this is very happy. Oh, I'm making it. Okay. How intriguing. Oh, okay. I got to check, choose the style and then the color. Curious indeed. I like that one. Ah, oh, is there not a... Ah, oh, you don't have a black one. You got a dark brown. How oh, intriguing. Like dark brown, pale brown, buff. Okay. Curious indeed. Oh, I didn't know it was going to be classic style. Now we don't want classic. How intriguing. I want Curious this one. indeed. And I guess this will do. Wood type. What does this do, though? Very large. See, I don't know what I had as my wand when I'd done the thing. Backroll. How intriguing. Make it massive. Little whippy. I don't want any of this stuff done. Unyielding. Stiff, rigid, solid, hard. I don't. Do we want it flexible? Curious indeed. Does that do anything? Phoenix, but I'm sure I got means yeah, that so is the core of a wand capable of producing a great range of magic. No for producing consistent, no for producing powerful. Huh. This one's highlighted. 
Why is that one highlighted? Hmm. Oh. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. Is there anything on the dragon? Ah, phoenix feather. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative. What did I say about the dragon? A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Yeah, this is what we'll have. We'll do this. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> Hell yeah. <sighs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Nice. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. Um, sir? There is no way I'm stuck. Oh, okay, thank you. Oh, box me in. Up, my dude. Seemingly wand. Nevada. <laughs> I officially have all of my supplies. <clears throat> Excellent. Did you get what you needed from your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Interesting sounds. Very interesting. Why? What? Oh! Oh, you want to go, bro? Oh, you're not ready for this. Are we weakening the core? Keep at it. We'll wear us down eventually. Repair Repair on him. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. Ooh. What was that? Taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. I just got huh? I just got what? I just didn't even notice. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, I. I I pushed everything wrong here. Confringo. Wrong button. Wrong button again. I'm sorry. Nope. That's right, snuffering loud. He's faltering. You won't get to do the job. Have a... Have a... There! Go ancient magic? Okay. Oh, about to come on me, are you? <laughs> okay. Goodness, a second troll.
Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Yeah, it's all good, it's all good. Repairer! Lucky they didn't do more damage. I'll go and see what he wants. Yeah, I'll just stack the boxes up, it's fine. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Um, when I went to do this, okay. Repairer. Uh oh. I like thank you. Ooh, this has to be a good one. Ah, oh, I thought it was gonna be like spinning around building it like okay. I'm not fully done yet, there's something over here as well. That's pretty cool, I can just repair that stuff just in front of you. Like I've always said the travel broadens the mind. Accuracy. Back here, thank you. Revelio. Thank you. Level up though. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Oh, now I can talk to you. Okay. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls. And not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. Ooh. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Mm, thank, you. thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall sound we? Like that? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. It's. You, I mean, you, you, you can keep that. It's not as good as mine. <laughs> uh, yeah, oh, you're going to actually make me look at gear. I've already been doing this. Can I just... Oh. There we go. Put my one back on, thank you. Ooh, that's a better one. 12 offense, no trait applied, no trait. Do any of these have a trait? I can preview stuff, cool. That doesn't look too bad. How does this look, do I ask? I do not like that at all. I can sell stuff, right? Yeah. Sell this. Sell that. Sell that. That. <sighs> this still ain't even going to be enough. Wait, isn't that the thing I've got on now? I just sell stuff I already have equipped. That's not possible. I'd say right. we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. There's a... I knew that thing would have one. I saw a scroll in the background there. Yeah, it was trying to make me sell the thing I... 
I'm using. Why? I don't like it when games do that. Not a fan at all. However, it didn't. Rebellion. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Mind? You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Well, thank you. I will come back when I can actually, you know, I guess earn some money. I'm not a fan of that. <laughs> if that gives me any stat boost, it is being invisible. Oh, I don't have it. Oh, okay, so it's just a lucky thing, yeah. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. <coughs> Man with a top hat. Oh! <gasps> Must be evil. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is... That if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <laughs> Let's go. Ah, oh, yes, walk out in front of them. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood, the goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Interesting. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. What's up, dude? Now, what can I... Oh... There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Nice. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say... <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade... That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Oh, oh. oh time, lame. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Oh, damn. My friend well, is enjoying go? a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Oof. Everyone's I stepping said, up. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. <laughs> One a bit. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything, but it's perhaps best I do that later. 
And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Yeah, that's uh. Run away, I damn <laughs> Pardon me, I damn step up. Where you at, boy? Sweat onto the troll. Come, Gravada! I'm certainly glad Serona was there. <coughs> Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Yeah, let's go. For the night access. Oh, okay. Am I just going to fast travel there? Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Select the Hogwarts button to switch to Hogwarts. Um. Ah, right at the top there. Grand staircase. Oh, okay, yeah, you just travel that, gotcha. That makes it easier. Alright, well, we got our wand. We took down our first tr boss. The troll. We got to see some more story. Nice. When it loads back in to the troll to make sure there's no other cutscenes, I will end of this episode I haven't I've just been playing straight through by the way from the first part to this part I've not stopped <laughs> I've, I've been enjoying this game a lot anyway thanks for watching hit the like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one bye